Not it. We're gonna eat one dollar fish tacos. We're gonna drive all the way back. <laughs> my crusty socks. Um, where's it pointing? <laughs> Why is it still on my socks? <laughs> no, <laughs> no, it's. <laughs> KJ, Jaron, and I were all in pole vault together at Rancho Bernardo High School. And then after pole vault season got canceled because of the COVID pandemic, we were like, oh, we could probably all surf together. Yucky. Yucky. <laughs> One day we were surfing, having a good time, and then we went to KJ's house. Uh, we were kicking into my room, then uh, we saw a guitar on the wall. Jaron picked up a guitar and we started just jam kicking it. And then I think we went back to that room one more time and we were like, wouldn't it be cool if we all played music together? And I think it just kind of spiraled into a, um, a band, if you will. Once that we had like, you know, sort of decided we, this was gonna be a thing we we're gonna do, we're like, okay, let's get another guy. Alec pops in. <laughs> bada bing, bada boom. So here we are in the San Marcos studio. We still practice in the garage for the most part. But whenever we can, we like to come here just because it's, it's cool. And this is where we recorded our new EP too. It was like right over there. Wax Balls, that's the last song. Also a really weird name. It's like, it's very, very shouty, very like sad, very depressing. Um, and then the second half really speeds up. It's my personal favorite song to play because the end is so fast, my hands can barely move. But then there's this part at the very end where we all yell together and I got the sound waves of that tattooed on my arm um, to just like commemorate um, music and the homies. And we were here when we made the song. I was talking to my friend Ethan Rose. He had mentioned that it was weird because he was just driving and then he had his playlist on shuffle and then it played the last song, Wax Balls, uh, in which I'm just shouting the whole song, and he thought it was kind of weird to just be driving down 15 hearing my voice shouting, so. I was in my friend Karen's car, and we were going to Laguna Beach, and we, she was shuffling music, and then our song, Orlando Blooming Onion, came on, and um, I was just like, oh shit, that's like our song. Just to like have something to say, I did that, you know? And then, like, I feel like as time like goes on, it's gonna be like weirder, because it's like, oh, that was me from like however long ago. It's a small venue in San Diego. They have a main stage and a side stage. We played one show at the side stage, and then we have another order show Saturday at the side stage. Well, at first, it's pretty nerve-wracking, but once you get up there, I'm kind of like in the zone. I'm not very nervous anymore. It's pretty fun after that. Soma was cool. Like, the first time we played, I was really nervous just because we hadn't played a venue before. But once we got there, everybody was really nice. So now it feels cool. It's like it's nice because the last show we played was under a freeway. But it's nice to go to Soma and, you know, have like a stage and lights and not have to worry about the police getting called. I think it's good to have people that you like to make music with. I think that's pretty important. We don't normally like beef ever when we're trying to write music, so I feel like it's good to have people that you know well. Well-oiled machine, you know what I'm saying? Hand motions and everything. They're mainly like like my friends, so we just happen to be in a band, you know? So it's cool to like just hang out with your friends and then you're also doing like creative stuff. Hopefully we're just gonna keep making music. We got more ideas for new songs and 
made another EP. I don't like to look too far into the future because the future scares me, but I like, I'd like to think that we can keep doing this for a little while longer. That is why we're playing there. Nice. We finessed our way in. Shave small. We cheated. They don't. They surf a lot more than we do because they're in college. And they have a lot more free time. I don't have that much free time. Don't you run in the surf club? <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. That's really funny. Oh. Don't be nervous. <laughs> who's, your, who's your inspiration? Like, like. Like a person. Hmm? Biggest fear. Death. Uh. Woman. <laughs> I don't even know. I don't even know what's in Horchata. POV shot. Yo! Hmm? No? Oh, I thought you were saying something. Anyway. I found the chords on this TikTok video, and I was like, oh, these are nice. And But it wasn't a song already, so I didn't steal it. I didn't steal it. I didn't steal it, no. I took it off. I know that, to unlock this shit. That the door. Oh, I can hack my window. I just need to start my vehicle. Yeah. Oh, I found it. Oh, good. It's blending in. Stream REP?